Hello, Hope Scopers, and welcome to our Paris Chateau. Yo. Sadly, Leo Scope was not able to make this Paris trip, so instead you get Tyler doing stuff in the background. Today, I am reviewing the highly anticipated review of Till You Collapse. Are you putting those on? <laughs> Tyler! You look hot in your jammies. I have a pair of shorts here and a pair of the heart booty leggings. These shorts have been just sitting in my room for about a month waiting to be reviewed. Okay, the first thing we need to talk about are the release dates and the shipping information about this brand. You can't just go online and buy a pair of leggings from these guys. You have to pre-order them four weeks in advance. So I ordered these shorts, pre-ordered these shorts, and I clicked order and exactly four weeks later they showed up on my doorstep. But the leggings took about six weeks to get to me. Come be in this. I seriously feel like I'm filming with Leo. Come here, come here. Say hi to YouTube. Okay, so I got the red heart booty shorts. They were $39.99. I can't remember how much they were to ship. Under $10. I know that. <laughs> They're made from a nylon spandex material, which I was kind of nervous about because you know how I feel about nylon, a sheer material. Generally shouldn't be used to make workout bottom. Okay. And then the second thing I got are the pink pastel heart booty leggings. The heart booty leggings were $59.99, so they're not necessarily cheap. So I'm expecting at least decent quality. Oh, it's a pretty color. Shipping was $4.16. They feel like pretty much the exact same material that the shorts are made out of. I'm nervous they're gonna be sheer, but they're cute. So I got a size small in both of these, which is supposed to be equivalent to a Lululemon size six. I feel like the shorts do run a little bit small. <laughs> these are supposed to have a great amount of compression and they are guaranteed to be 100% squat proof. We're gonna squat test these and you're gonna tell me if they're squat proof. There's no way these are gonna be squat proof. Here are the leggings. Ooh la la. Big moment of truth. Oh, I think that they're gonna pass. Really? Yeah. That's surprising, because yeah. they're so light colored. The length is good. Like they run a tiny bit looser than some leggings that I have, but like you said, if I would have gotten them a size smaller, I might be see So these leggings are being compared right and left to these leggings. They're inside out. I'm a stinking. <laughs> I'm on a plane for 10 hours. These are the All The Right Places by Lululemon and they are some of my all time favorite leggings. I would not say that these are identical to these. I'll be interested to see how they hold up though. Cause that's the main complaint with these ones is that they come unraveled. I like them. I do too. So I think I'm gonna wear these around Paris today and see how they do. Good call. So these are the shorts. They look pretty good. Do they? Yeah. That make my booty pop? Yep. I like the pockets though, and they're good length. Mostly. Mostly? <laughs> so what do you give them, like a B plus on squat proof? You're like, you're just gonna wear this thing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm in my pajamas. I'll link these pajamas below because they're really comfy. As far as how these compare to other shorts like this, I would say these ones are more high-waisted and longer than the Buff Bunny ones, but they're not as high-waisted and not as long as the Old Navy ones. They're just kind of the happy medium. I like these ones the best out of all of those. You do? I think I do too, actually. And they're all pretty much in the same price range. I think the Old Navy ones are a little bit cheaper. Let's see, outfit of the day. Show your outfit of the day. What the heck? <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. You wanna hear my duck joke? How do you say hello to a duck that is hard of hearing? Hello, duck! Till you collapse, I'm spilling raps and then. Uh...
That's all I know. I am back home with this fluff and stuff. I just thought that I'd do a quick little outro now that I have worn and washed both of these items. While I was in Paris, I did wear these around for an entire day. They were insanely comfortable. They have a really nice stretch to them and they're very breathable. As far as these grand comparisons that are floating around as to that these are exactly like Lululemon all the right places, that's not really true. Looks wise, yes. Fabric wise, not so much. I still have yet to find a pair of pocket leggings that are an exact dupe of the Lululemon all the right places just because they're more of a slick nylon material but they're thick enough that they're still squat proof, which is not easy to do. If I had to compare these to another legging, I would say that they are most similar to the Victoria's Secret knockout tight. They're made from a similar fabric that has more of a cottony feel, and they have a double layer on the waist for some added support. However, these do fit better than the Victoria's Secret knockouts. I feel like they have a lot more tummy control and they do perk up your little bum a lot nicer than those ones do. I have washed these. I did not find that the color faded at all or that they shrank, but I can tell you right now, if you're not careful with these, they will pill. I just threw them in the dryer without even thinking about it. I don't recommend you do that or else they will start to pill a lot sooner. And then there are also a couple of spots where I'm starting to get some fuzzies on the seams. But if you don't make the mistake I did and let them air dry, they will probably last you a lot longer. Overall, are these worth the $60? Yes, these are a fantastic pair of leggings. My mind is absolutely blown that they are this light in color and still squat proof. As far as the shorts go, I was able to get a workout in in these. They're the exact same material as the leggings. So ditto for everything I said about those. Like I stated before, they do run a little bit smaller than the leggings do. I love the stitching on the bum. I feel like it really does give you a nice shape. I'm not gonna say they're sweat proof because they're not, but I was sweating a decent amount and I didn't have any showing through. It wasn't profusely. If you're sweating profusely, it's eventually gonna soak through. But for the most part, these did really good. Neither of these have a front seam, so you don't have to worry about camel toe. Are these worth $40? If you are looking for a good pair of pocket shorts, yeah. Leo, come and say bye. Bye. I have received a million and one questions about this brand, so I hope that this helped answer some questions for you. And we will see you guys in the next video. Make sure to give this one a like before you leave. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Say bye, YouTube. Valentine's color theme that I have going on because <laughs> we're in the city of love. Yeah. Come here and love me. I would say you're gonna stretch them out, but your butt is significantly smaller than mine, so I guess we're good.